Hi everyone. Today I'm going to deal with a subject which causes plenty of aggro across the country on a daily basis and it's to do with roundabouts and it's to do with priority. Now I hear some people say on occasions that when they get onto a roundabout they've got priority and other people have to give way to them. Now what I'm going to show in today's video is that that's sort of right but it's also massively wrong. It states in the highway code that when you reach a roundabout you have to give way to traffic approaching from the right hand side. And also in a book that I use a fair bit, and most driving instructors do, um, a book called Driving Essential Skills, it's a DVSA publication, it also backs this up, it also uses the word approaching. Now I want to just stick with that word a second because a lot of people do think that you only give way to people who are on the roundabout and that's not the case. If you just think that you only give way to people on the roundabout it can make your emerges potentially dangerous and a big problem to people from the right because you're not looking at their approach speed. You've got an emerge to do and you're not thinking of what they're doing whatsoever. And it's not the case. You have to make certain that you can do these emerges without inconveniencing anyone from this right hand side. So let's go into this in a little bit more detail. The other thing that can be a problem is when people also add the mindset of when I'm on the roundabout, other people then have to give way to me. Let me explain. That's sort of correct, but it's also wrong, and massively wrong. There's no rule in the highway code again, or even in driving essential skills, that says when you are on the roundabout, other people have to give way to you. It's sort of common sense, but what is it used for if I'm saying that it's not actually totally right. Well, it's used for people who come barreling onto roundabouts and then try and beat the horn or even crash into people who have emerged poorly, and people do. But these poor emerges are also made by people who think that when they get to the roundabout, they've got priority. It sort of causes a race to get there. And if you are emerging properly and giving way to this right hand side there's no issue with that second statement of now I'm on everyone has to give way to me because you don't actually need it. I'm not actually sure where this interpretation of this little piece of common sense actually came from because um, traffic is designed to flow around roundabouts that's why they're there but all this does it causes conflict between people coming on the right and people emerging so to all the people who do solely think when i get to the roundabout everyone else has to give way to me you're the problem it's not like that just remember, if you give way to the right properly and don't inconvenience anyone, that statement that I've just made about when I'm on the roundabout, you have to give way to me, doesn't even come into play. So you have to emerge depending on the traffic conditions, the vehicle you're, that you're riding or driving. Say, for example, you're a big slow lorry. Yes, I know lorries can have a problem getting out into roundabouts. And other people really need to be accommodating of that, but the lorry driver should be able to get onto a roundabout without causing inconvenience. I know there's certain times where that's not the case. So that's a perfect example. Sorry to interrupt the flow there, and I'm doing exactly the same with the pedestrian. That's exactly what that rule's for. If people emerge poorly, give way to them. 
but don't use it as an excuse for a poor emerge. I'll leave you thinking with that one. In the meantime, keep safe and I hope to see you all soon.